When he really whipped me though was when I robbed the store. On the Frank Fire and had a little old store down there. And he was my mother's brother and he had a coal oil bear in the back of the store. Back then folks bought coal oil for the lamps, didn't have electricity. And, and uh, he cut hair in Duck Hill's barber shop. And a lot of times they just closed the store and my cousin, little Bill Kirk, was over there visiting with me and they lived about four miles away and, and uh, I don't know how, how what made us decide we'd go get some candy out of the store, cigarettes. So I knew where he kept the key to the, the key to the store was at the cola oil barrel back then. So we got the key and went in the store and got a couple of bars of candy and opened up a pack of cigarettes and got some cigarettes out of it. He'd trade cigarettes for eggs. Somebody would come in, you know, give him two eggs. He'd give him one cigarette or two cigarettes. Or but anyway, we we headed on over to his house then, and I stayed over there two or three days. And uh, I was about eight, eight or nine years old. And come on that Sunday, and my mom was cooking supper and she said, you in trouble. I said, what? Well, you and little Bill robbed the store. <laughs> of course, I started that's denying that's it. And she said, no, that ain't no use denying it. They all robbed the store. Daddy come in. I was sitting there in the kitchen where she was cooking. And there we were getting had a little old safe there. <laughs> Kept dishes in and, and had a box of Lipton tea then. I got that Lipton tea and memorized every word on that box because I knew I was in trouble. Daddy come in and he had some brand new logging harness and uh, had some big old white horses and, and that harness was, the belly band was about that wide and about a half inch, three inch, inch a half inch thick and about three foot long. <laughs> He didn't say a word. He just took his belly band and started whipping. And I blistered and peeled off. Just How did they know it was you? Off. I was the only one that could be. <laughs> Maybe your friend ratted you out. Did that, did that end your life of crime? That, that ended my life of crime. <laughs> I never knew about that.